Thank you, Sisto. Let me begin by thanking everyone for turning out tonight. Um, Opportunity Organizing for America for taking this on the road and for all of you for coming out here on a, on a work night and, and sticking it out through the beginnings of a little rain here. Before I talk about what Senator Bingaman is doing on health care, I have a few questions for you and I want to take your responses back to him. Can you tell me, do you support comprehensive health care reform now? Yeah. How about a strong public option now? Yeah. How about fixing this situation where 47 million Americans don't have insurance? Yeah. We're getting insurance for the one-fifth of New Mexicans that don't have it. Yeah. All right. Folks, on a, on, a, on a more somber note, we lost a, a great leader, Teddy Kennedy, the other night. Uh, back in January, I was with Senator Bingaman in Las Cruces at NMSU early on a Saturday morning. And Senator Kennedy called him, and, and because of his illness, he asked uh, uh, Jeff to take charge of, of extending health care coverage to all Americans. And we did that. The, the health care uh, plan coming out of the health committee in the Senate gets us just about there. It's all our plans and vastly increased coverage. Senator Bingham is one of the key architects of that bill, and he's proud of that work. He strongly supports a strong public option. And we're lucky here in New Mexico. We have two Democratic senators, and they both support comprehensive health care reform. And both Tom Udall and Jeff Bingham support the public option. <laughs> 